Two years ago, the runners went to the big dance. Last year, their season ended at Madison Square Garden in New York. But the question is, can they make it three straight successful seasons? Ron Barnes facing a bit of a predicament entering the season. You see the points per game average from last year's seniors and that big number 37 circled because that is what Barnes has to replace. And tonight we got our first answer as to just who's going to be scoring all of those points. Well, before they even took the court, a ceremony to honor last year's team, the banner unveiled from the NIT run. Also, the rings handed out, T.J. Basil and Matt Smith on hand to get theirs. But the runners were slow out of the gates. Whittier, certainly the more physical team inside. CSUB would not take their first lead of the game until after this Motaz Ali slam. 15 minutes into the game, but just before the break, a returning face. Damian Durham nailing the buzzer three. And the runners take a 13-point lead into the break. As for where those points are going to come from this year, maybe this guy, freshman from Mississippi, Jarkel Joyner, finished with a game-high 23 points as the runners handle their home opener. Coach Barnes talked about his team's slow start, but first, here's senior guard Brent Rapp on the team's outlook for the new year. Last season's over. We got this season to look forward to, and uh, we need to do some new things this year. You know, last season's in the past, and we can't be dwelling on that and what we did last year. We got to... Uh, this is a different team. It's a different year with different guys, and we need to uh, establish ourselves because no one's going to give us any credit. Until we get out there a lot, like this is Brent's really first game, you know, and now we're playing in beside two guys. So it's almost, <laughs> I mean, for the first three games, we, we started with a new team. Whenever that's happening, there's going to be breakdown. So the runners won't be back inside the Accardo Center until December 2nd. They are going out on a long road trip. You heard Coach Barnes saying his team needs to get a lot better. That's because next Thursday, they're playing the number three team in the country, the University of Arizona. For now, inside the Accardo Center, Stephen Hicks, 23 ABC Sports.